Hi everyone, um, just a quick update for me. On today is the 3rd of March, Thursday the 3rd of March 2022. On Tuesday I received a very exciting phone call from my surgeon's office offering me a spot in their surgeries for this coming Monday. Um, I had surgery originally scheduled for the 28th of January and that got cancelled because of COVID so I have been waiting for another surgery date. Um, unfortunately there was someone else on the list who got whose child got COVID so they were not unable to have their surgery. Um, fortunately for me I got offered that spot so um, I was very excited to take that spot um, excited but freaking out but excited but freaking out so it's been a hectic week um, so initially I think a lot of the feelings were excitement um, and then I started feeling a bit overwhelmed um, also trying to get everything at work organized so quickly um, realizing what was coming up um, my senior manager is also going to be off work from Monday for a month so that for the business it's not convenient um, but I have an awesome team that I work together with and um, my colleagues have all just rallied around and encouraged me to go for it um, and I do feel that it's the right thing for me to do so um, this, I've been trying to get through all my lists and make sure that everything is in place for the time that I'm away um, so yesterday and today I've been focusing on work tomorrow being Friday I'll try and finish off the last few, th few things that have to be in place um, once everything well once the end of Friday happens tomorrow um, I need to switch off my computer and start focusing on what I need to have ready and waiting for me for when I get home from the surgery. Um, my husband is unable to take time of work to take me to the hospital. Unfortunately, my youngest daughter and um, her partner will be taking me to the hospital. Um, with COVID currently in Melbourne, they'll just have to drop me off outside the hospital and I'll have to do the whole um, sign myself in and get myself sorted anyway so that's not a big deal um, and fortunately my youngest daughter is training to be a hairdresser so she can put my hair in a French braid which will be really convenient um, I think waking up and your hair is in a braid and you groggy is going to be a really good idea so that's my plan um, other than that I need to go through my hospital list make sure I've got everything packed in without packing too much um, then also make sure that I've got some bone broth prepared for next week um, I'm not crazy about bought bone broth so I'm going to try and prepare some from scratch and freeze it um, also remembering that you can only drink a quarter of a cup to half a cup so not a whole pot full um, it'll just be a little bit just so that I have something um, I'm also trying to make sure that I've got any 
anything on order that vitamins or um, any anything that I might need when once I get home make sure I get them ordered now um, so that they're already on their way so that was just a quick update about what's happening um, I'll try and give another update over the weekend um, I want to do an update about why I'm doing this because it's a big deal for me um, so I'd like to go into a bit of that um, and maybe it helps someone so I'm looking forward to I'm looking forward to it now I think I've got over the initial nerves and now I'm just looking forward to having it done and having it behind me so chat again soon